Okay, so I'm doing my second um, air streak, and I bought the decals from Airframes Alaska, but I decided to go with these paint pens, uh, tire ink. There we go. Um, first one, that's it finished. It definitely, uh, I put on three coats and I tried to draw on the lettering and much better technique is tap, 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 get it dialed into where it's wet. And then, I don't know if I can do this with camera. There we go. You just kind of dab it on and then if a bunch of um, paint comes out, then you can just kind of move it around. And I found this to be a much cleaner technique. It lays on better. And they say, you know, you're supposed to put on multiple coats. You let it sit. It's the problem with that, which I mean, I'll come back and do another coat, but the uh, problem with that is you actually, as soon as you get this paint wet, like with the second coat, it starts to smear it and move the um, bottom coat around. And so I'm just documenting how I'm doing this. And I'm, do you know, I don't really care with the, hopefully it'll look good on the plane, but I am waiting for my tail to set up enough to where I can start working on a different part. And I just kind of leave these out and I just, you know, just do this when I get bored and want to work on something else. So I'm basically, I'm almost done with this, uh, with both of my wheels. And you notice I miss a spot, get a little acetone, just brings it, takes it right off. I have a bunch of Q-tips that I'll use. I mean, I'm not worried about getting it anywhere. Um, I just do pay attention to it just because it minimizes the amount of cleanup I'm gonna have to do. But just showing and I'm starting to mess up a little bit trying to hold a camera in my hand and do this at the same time. But you get the gist of how it's going. I just did the Alaskan logo. This I did last week. And you know, it's nice. And I, I threw a little white on there just to try and mix it up. Um, the Alaskan bush wheels say Alaska and Bushwheel and they're kind of more balanced on the, uh, you know, all the way around. This one says Air Streak. So I don't know, I'm just kind of messing around. Literally, I could take all this off. Um, not as easy to flip them around because I'd have to take the wheels off, the, um, the centers, uh, Behringer wheels out. But I mean, I could take some acetone and wipe it off. So it's not the end of the world. And I just thought the stickers, which I, I don't know where they are right now. Um, I just thought this would be a, a better way to go. So let me know what you think.